first step was sanding it down. Got a nice 4x6 piece of wood. Put some uh, primer paint all sides. Cut uh, some legs from some 4x4s. Try to make it as straight as possible. I don't have the best tools, just a handsaw and a skill saw. Then I did some rough measurements for some feet, some 2x4s, some more primer and paint. It came out pretty flush, actually. I piloted some holes here so that I can deep sink these shorter screws. And uh, then I was able to drill them through. I got caught. <laughs> Nothing going on here. Then I went ahead and fastened these. Love that Dewalt drill. It came out surprisingly straight. None of my wood is, all my wood is reclaimed. Uh, so recycled wood from other projects. Trying it out myself, 170 pounds, pretty sturdy with no support, just screws. Pretty happy with that. This is some old movers blanket that I have. Gonna use it as some padding. I'm not a fabricator, so I just nailed it on. And cut it, cut the corners, make it look clean. Quick on the other side as well. Double folded it over. This is it. I put some uh, braces on there just for some more stability. And I had an extra bracket left over from another project I did. I didn't buy any new material. This is all recycled. Actually, I lied. I had this outdoor cloth I bought at Walmart. It's like 15 bucks. Pretty cheap. My first time fabricating job. It came out pretty awesome, if you ask me. Okay, it's coming. Claire, All right, here's the big reveal on her fourth birthday. Yeah, she's surprised. All right. No way. <gasps> Kids had a blast. Practicing all day long, you can see in her eyes. She's dreaming of those front flips, back flips, somersaults, and spins. <laughs> <laughs>